Hi everybody, welcome back to Armour of Forger and on the experimental version of the game we now have these beauties, anti-tank mines. <laughs> There's a Russian version and an American version. I've been doing a little bit of testing to kind of try them out. So let's go into this Russian, I think this is the Russian Armoury one, let's have a look. Uh, yeah, so the Russians get the TM-62 anti-tank mine. Um, and to kind of um, kind of equip them, you kind of put them in your backpack. And I think either I'm doing something wrong or it's a little bit glitched at the moment because I don't seem to be able to... Oh, there we go, number two. There we go. Oh, there we go. He's got his mine out. <laughs> He's like, oh, it's really heavy. Here we go. Here we go. So let's put our mine down. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. He puts it in place. I think he's armed it as well. Yeah, pretty sure he's armed that. All right, that's good. So that's the Russian one. Let's grab the uh, American one as well. It can be a little bit fiddly, that, though. That's the first time I've actually managed to get one of them to um, uh, use a mine like that. So this is the M15. So the way that I was having to do it was I was having to do it like this. So I was just dropping them on the floor like that and then arming them that way. Now, what's interesting about these mines is, at the moment anyway, you've got to be quite careful how you drive over them to set them off. So, I guess the, the real way of saying that is that if you want to stop, say, um, a vehicle, it's important probably not to just have one mine on a road if you want to do an ambush, because they're pressure mines, they're not magnetic mines, and so if a vehicle drives over with its tracks or wheels either side of the mine, it won't actually set them off. Um, and so what we'll do, let's drive over a mine in a Humvee first, just to show you, and then uh, I'll drive over a mine in, a, um, in, in the Russian armoured vehicle. Now, what you'll see if we start her up, so let's see if I can dr drive over it without setting it off. There we go. See, I drove over that setting off because my wheels didn't touch it. But then if we touch it with one of our wheels. <laughs> As you can see, uh, yeah, not very well. Okay, so let's uh, spawn in another character. In fact, it's only fair really to spawn in a Russian, isn't it? Spawn in a Russian. Let's take control of this guy. And let's jump in the uh, BMP or BTR. Apologies if I get it wrong. I am terrible at doing that. Uh, which side do you get in? Do you get in this side? Get in right there. Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's back up a little bit. Oop. <laughs> oh dear, there was a mine there. Okay, so you see what it, see what happens. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to spawn in a rifleman there, and then we need to spawn in a. It's the BTR, isn't it? Spawn in a BTR there. So let's take control of this guy. Right, I'll try and drive over the mine without setting it off first. It's a bit trickier in the BTR because it has so many wheels. See if we can get over it. There we go, see? At first, when I started testing them, I thought they were like smart mines almost, where they would only go off underneath the, re the respective enemy's um, vehicles. But if we drive over it this way now... There we go, bang. And... <laughs> So they're really, really, really effective. Very, very cool indeed. Um, we'll have to do with some testing, I guess, with the mods, with like the M1 Abrams mod um, and like the Striker mod. But you can always already imagine the fun you'll have setting ambushes for or setting scenarios up where you've got like an armoured com column coming through um, and you're blowing them up with your mind. So there we go. Mines are now live on the experimental versions of Armour Reforger. Remember, if you own Armour Reforger, you can get experimental for free for Xbox and PC and you can do a little bit of testing with the um, newer version of the game that will be coming to everybody in a few weeks' time. A few weeks' time. Anyway, that's enough for me. If you've enjoyed that, hit like. If you want to see more, press subscribe. And of course, I'll see you again soon.